Hi! So if you don't know me by now, I mean most of you know me. My name is Alyssa, I'm 24. I am going to start um, making YouTube videos of myself and this is just to keep myself accountable. I found over the last couple of years that um, I get super motivated to work out and lose 10 or 15 pounds because you know I don't want to be super skinny. I, that's what I always say. I'm like I don't want to be super skinny, I just want to do it to be healthy. And um, I always wind up putting it back on. I renege. I go back on my word. I just, I don't follow through. And it's because I know I like to put myself last on the list. Instead of um, making myself a priority, I make everyone else and everything else, extracurriculars and going to the bar, or doing other things for other people, um, priority. But that's going to change. It's hard hearing the truth. Um, especially, you can't always have like random people being like, you know, or the pe there, there's the people that'll come in and say, you look great, and no, I don't, like, I look the same I have for the past six months, like, I haven't seen any changes, have you? <laughs> and I, I know they mean well, but um, it takes that one, one, two, or three people in your life that can tell you, okay, like, knock it off, pull it together, and you gotta thank God for those people, and I'm glad that I have those two to three people in my life that, um, know when I'm struggling and they know my heart and they know that like okay like it's Alyssa's turn like Alyssa needs to do something about you know Alyssa's stuff so I just want to keep um tabs on myself and I mean I think it's kind of cool like to let people like follow along like and see what I'm doing like I want to do I want I mean I don't know I just want to hold myself accountable like I'm tired of um pause 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 well I took the summer off kind of I was just really you know into a new work schedule and I just I was like okay I'll go to boot camp oh okay maybe not I'll go tomorrow and like it just turned into wow like I only went to three camps out of six weeks like what's wrong with me like that come on pull it together and um my first real like back to the studio workout was Thursday and I just left crying and I was so disappointed and I was like how did I let myself fall off that hard like how like how do I do that like I'm sitting here telling people to go work out and I'm not doing it myself and it just bothered me <laughs> and um I just I that's what I, I I don't know sometimes you need your best friend which she did just kind of slap you in the face and be like okay like get over your pretty party and get your butt back in the studio so I am and that's why I'm doing this you know to keep myself accountable and just I'm just ready like I'm ready for the change I've never been I've always been scared I'm like what if people talk about me and if I get too skinny or I get too much muscle and I don't care it's my body I'm I have to feel happy like they're not doing the work I am so I'm ready to do it for me and not for anybody else I just feel like it's my turn now and um, I need to quit putting myself last on the list and um, really need to start taking time for myself to make sure you know I don't want to be a size 2 I, I don't think I'll ever do a, a figure or bikini competition, but um, I don't want to have diabetes. I don't want to, I mean, that runs in my family. I've been overweight my whole life, so I've never, I don't know what skinny feels like. I know what it, I know, well, I do when I don't eat all day, but <laughs> I, I've never been lower. I've, I, this, is, this isn't the heaviest I've ever weighed, but I don't want to be this heavy anymore, and I don't want to, I don't know, I just want to make everyone proud and make myself proud and feel good and I just want to know that I'm healthy and I'm whole and I'm, I'm happy with myself and I'm happy but I know there can be a happier improved version of myself so here we go so I'm gonna be kind of um just I mean I work out work for one place so um, I'm just gonna keep track I, I got all my food prepped I'm super excited about it for this week um, I'm ready to do this I'm ready to you know workouts I did back-to-back -back workouts today I did a spin class at my job which is Hair Factor Fitness and I did a 2020 class which is uh, free weights and that was uh, an hour or two so I'm pretty sore I'm gonna probably walk funny tomorrow so <laughs> I'm pretty excited about that I forgot how how it hurts so good it hurts so good I know it sounds funny but it does hurt so good you know I was that girl that could only do two push-ups and then drop down to my knees and do girl push-ups and you know then I advanced from that and now I'm back at square one I can't, I'm like holy crap like 
I let myself go that far. I can't even do like 10 push-ups. Like, uh, someone call 911 because that ain't cute. That ain't cute. But everybody has to start somewhere and I'm happy that I'm at a place where like I can do that. Like no one judges me. No one says, you did 10 uh, last year on your finger fingertips and your tippy toes with a snake on your back and you can't do it now? No. Like, but that's what it's about. Like that, you know, that's what Sarah tells me. Well, us, everyone, Fit Fam, everyone in America, that it's the highs and the lows that you're going to gain weight, you're going to lose weight, you're going to look shredded, you're not going to look shredded, you're me on a period, you're going to have water weight, no water weight. Don't go on steroids. <laughs> so it's just all kinds of different things that just kind of play and play a part and play a part in it. So let's do this. I'm ready. Are you? Yeah. <laughs>